Hello everybody, this is Binks with the BFGC. And I'm gonna play Shovel Knight. Wicked excited, so this is made by Yacht Club Games. Okay, this is the first time I'm actually playing this. Steve, oh, what? Oh, okay, that just means that I don't have a save already. Okay. All right, let's see what options we got. Uh, game options. Cool. So, music. It's cool. Uh, new adventure. Oop, start does not go to done. Alright, so before I actually press confirm on this. Um, so this game was a Kickstarter, I think, from last March, maybe March 2013. I've been waiting for it pretty much since then, since I saw it. Uh, the description on this game is... It's like a mix, a hybrid mix of the best NES games ever made. So, there's elements of uh, Mega Man. You guys, uh, everyone should know I'm a huge Mega Man fan. Uh, Mario 3, which is my favorite game of all time. Castlevania 3, another awesome game. DuckTales, another awesome game. And there's some uh, Zelda 2 kind of hub world stuff, some towns. So let's do this. I am very excited. Oh, he has a little partner. Long ago, the lands were untamed and roamed by legendary adventurers. Of all heroes, none shone, shone, shone brighter than Shovel Knight and Shield Knight. But their travels together ended at the Tower of Fate when a cursed amulet brought up terrible magic. When Shovel Knight awoke, the tower was sealed and Shield Knight was gone. Oh, hey, that's kind of like Mega Man and Zero, the color scheme there. His spirit broken, a grieving Shovel Knight went into a life of solitude. But without champions, the land was seized by a vile power, the Enchantress, and her order of no quarter. Haha, <laughs> I like that. Now the tower is unsealed and devastation looms. A new adventure is about to begin. Dot, dot, dot. Look at Shovel Knight there, standing like a badass. Oh, here we go. Alright. Okay, super tight controls. That's good. So you use, uh, I'm using the Xbox One controller. Same as the Xbox 360, so... Uh, X or B is to use your shovel and dig. A is jump, and if you hold him down, you bounce on things. Uh, if you ever played the NES DuckTales, which was just remastered in HD, you'll know what that is. It's like Scrooge McDuck's Pogo. Oh, this game is so good. Only just getting started. Listen to that music. Just listen to it. I'm surprised like there's no other games that, that ever did the whole pogo stick kind of thing. Oh, ah. Quick thinking on my part there. You're welcome. What's this? Okay. I can interact with it, but I don't know. It's probably a, it's probably a checkpoint. That is my guess. So, we're picking up a lot of gold and gems and stuff. There's a big one. Oh, fuck. I'm not really sure what that stuff's for yet. I try to stay away from the media in this game. Since it launched. Oh, fuck. Because I didn't want anything... I don't think there's going to be much spoilers in it, because it's just a NES-style game. But I'm guessing I can buy some stuff with all this sweet loot. Ooh. That's cool. Oh, 
two at a time. Shovel Knight does not mess around. Okay, cool. That was wicked. This game... Fuck. This game is so good, though. Like, it's very responsive. Oh, I'm so happy with this now. Yeah, uh, as I was saying, I just bought this on Steam. It just came out. Um... Oh, secrets. Just came out about an hour, maybe an hour and a half ago. And I was at work, but I bought it and downloaded it through my phone. And now it's it's here. What's that? Oh. Thought it was gonna be something cooler. This game is just very satisfying to play. The controls are so good. And if you play DuckTales, this feels good. If you, you'll know what I mean. Ah, shit. I will kill you, Rob. What's this? Turkey dinner. I imagine that's pretty cool. What's this? Super gem. I like how there's tons of secrets already. They're kind of noticeable if you... If you're like a old school gamer, you grew up in the 90s, you probably know a lot of this stuff. Or 80s. Whoa, frig, man. Cool. I can't leave a gem behind, it will bother me too much. Okay, so we got. Oh, sweet! We got this. Oh, well, we got that ladder, which. Let's get this through the ladder. Oh, that one seemed more of a secret. Okay, skeleton. I love... Whoa. So I should just start hitting walls all the time, maybe? See if they reveal secrets, because that was pretty sweet. Oh, treasure chest. Look at all that fat loot. Oh, I'm going to buy so many things. There's another checkpoint, so I'm going to go get that. Fuck you, buddy. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, didn't see. It was camouflage in the grass. This little tricky bugger. Oh, sick. Mad skills with Shovel Knight already. First tr first playthrough. Okay, we got the fuck. I got that dragon again. Oh, I almost fell down that hole. Holy shit! I almost fell down that hole as I said it. So don't fall down the hole. That's good. Oh, what was that skeleton head doing? Also known as a skull. Right? No! No! Yes. I didn't think I was going to be able to stop myself there. So you can stop yourself. Just so you know. Oh, my God. So many secrets. In the old uh, the NES DuckTales game, just crystals would just appear out of nowhere for pretty much no reason. I'm going to see what's over here. Oh, skills. Fat ass skills. More loot. Cool. Ooh, I was scared that was going to pop before I got to it. I don't know if that's even possible. Another save point. Okay. Black Knight, I knew you'd show your face sooner or later. The Cerulean coward. Whatever that means. Turn back, Shovel Knight. There's nothing here for you anymore. Stand aside, Black Knight. I've no quarrel with you. I must return to the Tower of Fate. Your time away has dulled your senses, can't you see? This entire valley has been conquered by the Enchantress. Enter Invincible Knights of Order of No Quarter! 
come between you and the tower. Oh. But none of that matters because anyone after the enchantress has to go through me. That guy looks pretty badass. Steal thy shovel. Oh, I'm gonna kill this guy super hard. Whoa. Fucking dummy. You're an idiot. <laughs> oh, what's he gonna do? Oh no. Oh, he's. Oh god, he's got super fast ones. What do you think? So cool shooting purple things at him. Oh, you bitch. Fuck you, buddy. Oh, I almost had a nice little combo go. Oh, that was wicked. Holy crap. Feet accomplished. I'm alive. I guess that's the tower in the background, maybe. Oh, you little bitch. <laughs> Shovel Knight's still just like, yeah, whatever, I still won. Down by a campfire. Sleeping. Hey, that's Shield Knight. I couldn't tell earlier, is Shield Knight a... Is she a babe? Oh, catch her. Yep. Uh, yeah. So she's still alive. Oh, I was fucking dreaming. Oh, I have to move my stick to, to wake up. Oh. It's a nightmare shovel. Man. Uh, only you. Achievement unlocked. Alright. Um... I'm just going to assume that was the first stage. Maybe I'll, I'll walk out. Oh, cool. So this is like the Mario 3 thing. It's like an overworld of map of stages. Very cool. All right, so that is Shovel Knight. I highly suggest picking it up. Um, I was reading up that it's about like five to eight hours, I think, playthrough, which is pretty long for uh, an NES-style game. Um, yeah, so check out our Twitter account at the underscore BFGC. Subscribe to our YouTube channel that you're watching right now. And check out our podcasts at the BFGC. Cool. Later.